This is a little video to show just one way of connecting an Osmo Pocket to an iPhone. This could be useful because of, as of this recording, DJI has not released any accessories for the device. Of course, you can connect it with this little adapter here, which when turned around goes directly into the end of the phone. But in this case, we're going to turn it around this way so it doesn't use the connector at all, and this is important. Next, we're going to take a USB Type-C to USB Type-A adapter cable. It's male USB-C to female USB-A, and Lauren plugs this into the bottom of the camera. Next, we take a regular USB to lightning cable and plug it in. So in effect, we're replicating the functionality of a dedicated USB-C to lightning male-to-male -male cable. And now we plug the lightning end into the phone. This should wake up the app, so now we have all the capabilities of the phone. So we can tilt the Osmo up and down, And of course, we can drag a box around this. So as Lauren moves the Osmo, the subject stays still. So this is a way of using a very inexpensive USB-C to USB-A adapter with your existing lightning cables. Now, the disadvantage of this approach is because we're going into the bottom, you can't put in an external charger or something like that. It's also possible if the Osmos adapter was turned around, we could use a lightning extension cord that has male on one side and female on the other, but I didn't have one of those around. So using the existing lightning USB cord into a simple USB-C to USB-A adapter seems to work just fine. And this way you could mount the Osmo Pocket someplace else, you could mount it high, and control it via the phone along the USB lightning cord. I hope you find this useful.